Hey, what's up, you guys? Today, I have Soli's limited edition photo book called Love Myself, which I am so excited to have. For those of you who don't know, um, Soli was my FX bias. I know I don't talk too much about FX on my channel. There is a picture of the only FX album I own, Red Light, on my Instagram. Um, this is a soft cover, which I kind of wish it was a hard cover, but... I did really want to get this because it is Soli's only piece of merch that she has put out since she left FX. Um, it doesn't come with any photo cards or anything, but I just really wanted it because I decided to officially collect Soli things. She doesn't have too much, so I thought, why not? The pages of this are matte and they're pretty thick, which is always nice to have. And, alright, so it looks like for each section they're going to label it. This one is on the road. She's just so model-esque. It already kind of feels like it's going to be a very, like, editorial magazine, almost like photo shoot. And I just love her styling. <laughs> she has bubbles there. I feel like, um, Sully has finally been able to reach being happy. Since she left FX, um, I love that color of dress on her. I think she finally was just able to find her own stride and what she wanted to do. I know she's been modeling a lot, um, not acting as much, but she has been modeling a lot, which is nice that SM is actually managing her since she's still signed underneath them. That's a nice color of red. Okay, so this section is called Hello Sunshine, and oh, I love this dress already. Like, it's so simple, but I already love it. <laughs> Her with strawberries. Sully, like, loves strawberries. She always has pictures of her with strawberries and things. This is cute. Oh, I love, I love the painting on the, um, car, like the flower truck. It's so pretty. Sometimes you guys ever wonder how, like, they find the props and stuff that they use for... It looks like a cookie, maybe a donut. I'm not too sure because it's in the crease. That they use for photo books and just photo shoots in general. It's like, where the heck do you find this stuff? Oh, it's a donut. <laughs> okay. Child. <laughs> I also kind of love how there's, like, a yellow theme throughout this and there's a sunflower, like... It's just perfect because she brightens up some, well, you know, she brightens up my day, I guess, when I actually see content from her. I do follow her on Instagram. She's pretty consistent posting there. This is cute. Oh, look at the dog. It's so cute. I'm honestly just really happy to have this. And I decided to, this is a, it's the same picture on the cover. I'm honestly just excited to have this because I haven't seen anyone else I love this purple color. I love, like, the shades of color they used. I'm sorry, I keep getting sidetracked. I haven't really seen an unboxing for this before, and I think that was, um, not fun at all. And I don't know if it's because not so many of these were sold or not. Um, this section's called Sunday Fun Day. Or if it's just people don't think unboxing photo books, like, means anything. Because I wasn't going to, but I was like, I feel like I need to share this. Because if I do end up talking about Soli, you guys are going to be like, oh, you're such a fake stan. You've never stan here before. I did. After I got into K-pop, FX was my first girl group after girls generation that I really got into. Um, and Soli was my bias as soon as I saw the group, so. Not a fake stan. <laughs> this is cute. She always has, like, a pop of yellow in these pictures, too. Which is just a nice touch since it looks like the theme of it was yellow since the cover is yellow. <laughs> I wish I could have Sully's proportions. I'm so short. Oh, with the watermelon. That kind of makes me think of um, Red Velvet's Red Flavor because of the watermelon with Irene. And... Oh, I just love it. I love this photo book. I'm so happy I got this. I was honestly so upset when the first website I was going to buy this from um, sold out of them. Ooh, I like the shade of pink too. Also, I know I need to get my nails done, just kind of ignore them. I'm kind of waiting for 
ticket prices to be announced for BTS's new tour, so I'm not doing anything until then. This section is called Lazy Afternoon, which who doesn't love a lazy afternoon? I like how they also threw in some pictures that are um, black and white in here. <laughs> Only silly. This is probably one of my favorite pictures because it just looks like she's having so much fun. And this is... It looks... It's reading is black on the screen, but it's like a dark green almost. Like a really dark green. Which is kind of funny because this section is called Joyful Joyful. And Joy is my red velvet bias and her color is green. That's pretty interesting. I wonder if they did that on purpose. I like this picture too. I honestly like... I don't think there's a picture in here of her that I don't like so far. Let me try to readjust this. There we go. Like, they were all picked very well, the pictures that they used. This is cute. The pictures that they used and the location they have. They just blow my mind how they find these locations. Like, how? I guess it helps when you have a whole team. Right. Wow. Like, I wish I could be that stunning, but I think every fan wishes that. I just love Sully so much, even though it's my first time talking about her. In the future, I'm probably not going to be able to shut up about her if she puts anything more out, which, sorry, but not sorry. I'm going to try to get as much Sully merch as I can. Like, look just how tall she is. Like, that reach. Like, jeez. On a wooden horse. I like the collages. This is pretty cute. I'm trying to make sure everything stays in frame, but it's a little bit difficult. Okay, there we go. Oh, I really, I like this. I think this might be my favorite styling that she's had. And the person in the back who's like, who the heck is she? Why are you here? My hands are so tiny. Okay, here we go. This might be my favorite picture out of the whole book. And I like that it's mint green and purple. Like the complementary colors and everything that they do in this. This is like a coral pink. This is kind of like um, Red Velvet's official fan color pink. Maybe, or maybe it's supposed to be peach because um, Zoli was always called a peach when she was in FX. So maybe that's what it is. This is called Dreamy Time, which I really love the styling in this, but this is definitely my favorite outfit. Whoop. Here we go. Sometimes it's hard to see in the viewfinder how close I have it all in frame, so here we go. This is like, I really like this uh, um, through the fountain shots. I honestly just really like this photo book. <laughs> I'm so happy that I decided that I needed this. Because I did. Though so I know um, I wasn't going to actually collect photo books. And here's the color, yellow color. And then here is the credit page. And that was the end of the photo book. So all in all, I do love this. I'm so happy I got it. It was pretty difficult to find because it was a limited edition. And since she's not in a K-pop group anymore, it seems that not a lot of places decided to try to carry it or get it because um, she's not an FX. I don't know if that's the reason, but that's kind of the reason it felt to me. So I did get this from eBay from Great Music CD, which thankfully they actually had it. I was so worried it wasn't going to come. I thought it was lost in the mail for a little bit, but it finally got here so I could unbox it for you guys. Um, so I originally wasn't going to collect photo books, but then I decided why not? So I'm only collecting um, Taehung and Joy so far, that's what I was going to do. Then Soli released this and I was like, well I might as well try to grab Soli's since she doesn't put out a lot of merch and even going back through FX she doesn't have a ton. So um, I'm probably going to try to get as much Soli merch as I can whenever she puts it out. So you should expect to see her a bit, probably see more photo books coming. I don't know, I think I'm kind of getting the full bug of I need to collect photo books for my biases too and everything, but I'm trying to limit the biases that I actually collect that way, um, 
And here we go again, once again I'm rambling. It's not an unboxing here unless I ramble, right? So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is my unboxing of Sully's limited edition photo book, Love Myself. Thank you all so much for watching, and I do hope you enjoyed.